everyone likes to say that the first player that comes out has to be a star. And that would be nice because that would make sure, you know, there'd be no questions about, about his job, about his production, anything like that. I've always said that if I was a, a role player, a third or fourth line guy in the NHL or a seventh man in the NBA, I'd come out just for the book deal. Like you're going to make more money and make more of an impact and ha have a long-term effect on the sports world by coming out than you are if you play four or five years and kick around the league a little bit. So I don't think it has to be a star. Um, I think that would be nice. I think in the ideal world, yes, the best player in each league, it would turn out, happens to be gay. And then everything flips right away. But I don't think it has to be. I think if it's a role player, role players, by the way, are often generally more well-liked. I know in the National Hockey League, the third and fourth line guys who do the dirty work, who hit, who fight, who block shots, both by fans and by teammates, are often more well-liked than the superstar prima donna type. Um, so I, I don't think it has to be a star. Would we like it to be a star? Yes. Does it have to be? No. We just need one guy to get the ball rolling.